for today. <coughs> How's it going? What's good? How you doing? How you doing, people? We're back with another episode of Grief Fall. I, I'm gonna be honest with you, it's been a minute since I played the game. I have no idea where we left off. When Shaganol. I don't know what part of the story we're at. I know we're like a good level in or something of like that. I just, I don't exactly remember where we left off. And I would like to know. So we're gonna load in and figure it out. You and me together. You and me, chat. We're going to figure it out together. You and me against the world. The world being greedful. I hope you're ready for it. Because I am. Okay, what... Where are we? Where are we in the story? The suffering of Constantine. Talk to the missionaries. There is a side quest that we were supposed to do, I believe. Fourth challenge... Um, talk to the captain at the outpost. Offer Vasco your help. Uh, I guess this is it. Okay, yeah, I guess this is it. Where are we? Can I steal from this? One? Is that a side quest? You guys got you guys got a uh, pantaloons in here? No. Okay. Unfortunately. Right, let's go ahead and get in here. I don't remember why we were here in the first place. I'm gonna be honest with you. Talk to the missionaries. Where are the missionaries? Where are we? Where are we? Why are they so far away? Why am I slow? Oh, you're gonna have to give me a second to remember how to play this game. I've been playing. I've been playing COD. My goodness, stop. I've been playing uh, a little bit of COD, a little bit of, you know, a little bit of shooters lately. Been hanging out with some buddies. We're playing some DMZ. Which I'm gonna be honest with you, I didn't think DMZ was gonna be kind of fun. Oh, let's go. Level 17. Already? Yeah, we're cracked. Oh, we're cracked. Beast doesn't. So put away your sword. Thank you. Let's go. I'm stuck. Let's go meet these mercenaries. I have no idea where you guys are. Uh, I'm gonna assume on the other side of this bridge. But yeah, I've been playing a little bit of MW2, a little bit of DMZ. Been, you know, chilling, having some fun. It's a good game. Kind of a. It's kind of annoying. DMZ is fun, but it's a little annoying when I get new weapons and I just want to XP right off the bat. Just to unlock a weapon. The only reason is like I, I just want to get all the weapons unlocked and then not have to worry about it later on, you know what I mean? Like that way I can just keep running around doing all the missions. What the hell is that? Is that a quest board? Is this a quest board? That was a quest board! Sick! Good day. I'm the legate of the Congregation of Merchants on this isle. Might I'm I ask legate. you a few questions? Of course. Our allies from the continent are always welcome among us. What do you want to know? Uh. Could you tell the me what the mission here is? We must return these lost souls to the light and guide them so that they might receive the revelation. We have constructed the perfect village, Eden, where they might discover peace. In this protected paradise, they can receive divine teachings 
and join the illuminated chosen people. Mm hmm. Have you heard and why are you attacking the village? the village? I didn't know those creatures were given that name, but yes, we have heard talk about the attacks. We offered them our help and some comfort in their most difficult hour. In exchange for some inspiring conversation, I suppose. Of course. These horrible beasts have most certainly been sent by the demons of this isle. To chase only a few away would be of no use. If they truly desire peace, they must see the light. You haven't been victim of these attacks? On occasion, yes. But thanks to the Illuminated, we were able to chase them away with little effort. You seem to what about your connections? The of these Tenlands is somehow linked to the demons on the Isle. Whereas these are creatures that the natives have always known. They nest beside them. These are familiar beasts, but hasn't anyone informed you that their patterns have changed? These creatures really? have been riled up by the demons of the island, who have come to realize we are near victory. Sending them against these poor people. They maintain them in a state of fear and obedience to their shaman healer. There is only one way to truly make these attacks cease, my child. Convert these people. Defeat these demons. The Danegad of this village wishes for you to depart. You disturb the tranquility of their village. And you expect us to obey him? Haven't you understood that he is a servant of the island's demons? To leave would be to abandon the simplistic souls of all those that follow him, ceding victory to the demons. No, what my are child. You on about? We will not leave this place until the light I shines will fight over every dwelling. And for how We're about to fight. We've been alone here attempting to bring them to the light, my sister. A long time, but that is of little import. Bringing over but a single soul. My sister. It is my sad regret to announce that San Mateus has fallen into the hands of the coin guard. Our mother cardinal has found refuge in the court of his highness Constantin Dorsey, in New Serene. You do understand that maintaining privileged relations with our ally is now of utmost importance. What are you saying? Let's just say that, that ceding to, leave. to his requests seems to be the most gracious of paths. Very well, my father. We shall leave as soon as we are ready to travel. Aww. Thank you. Thanks, Petrus. I hate you, but thanks. Uh, alright. We need... Intuition level 2 would be nice. But we need vigor and stuff now. For later areas. <coughs> so we have two points. Let's go ahead and get this. What is this? Okay. That works for me. Let's go ahead and swap out some of our gear. Oh, that's right. I don't have endurance for. Caught having endurance right now would be so good. I'd only be able to get to three though. Okay, do we have to go back? Talk to the hunter. Okay. I don't know where I'm going. At least they complied with us on this one. I honestly didn't want to have to fight them, but you know, if they came down to it, you know, big sword time, they would have just, you know, you, you guys have seen this sword in action. They would have just died. This place looks nice though. I, I like how it's it's not open world open world it's like semi open world but it's kind of nice i like it it's not bad but it's not the best either if you know what i mean i oh, i'm stuck i'm stuck i'm stuck i'm stuck i'm stuck no 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 get out of my way no 
Yo, I can't be stuck here. No. No. You're kidding. You're actually kidding me. Okay, phew. Whew. I thought I was stuck stuck. Holy. Good day. Are you the master hunter? Beur tir tu madre naikse. I am indeed one and the same person. What do you want of me? Um, the Dunegad, Katasach, spoke to me about the animal the attacks. Can you tell me more? The Ten Lands have been angered. They are very angry. The beasts have always lived here. But they only attack if we tread near their nest. Of late, they attack on sight. There have been many wounded, and some of our young have even disappeared. It may be no, that not the, the young killed them, but it is also possible they followed the missionaries. What can you tell me about the Tenlands? That's interesting. They are normally very peaceful creatures, very calm, but who defend their young with fury. During the attacks, I noticed that they were not all the same. Not all from the same nest. What do you mean? That the other beasts don't come from here, but from other places. And that they are coming more and more often. Really? Were there many victims? Many wounded. Thanks to mm. the healing powers of the Donegan, they survived. But the attacks happen more and more often. And they come with greater fury. I try to chase them away. To destroy any nests that I found. But still, more of them come. And now our children disappear. The stress alone could kill our village. Can you tell me who the children are? A young fisherman and a gatherer. You will find the sister of the woman and the brother of the man in the village. I will go and see them. That's interesting to, um... I must be going. To find out, like, this kind of information about the Ten Lens and them being super aggressive. Oh, I'm not done talking to you yet, okay. I'm in need of your wisdom. I hear you. Uh, Isn't it aggressive. That these creatures who are normally passive have become so aggressive. Yes. Yes. This has never happened in my lifetime. What do you know? Speak. Lives are at risk. I do not speak of things I am not sure of. The Renaixe, like you, do not understand the bond we have with nature. Hmm. I must be going. Okay, I think that's everything. Yeah. So... Why do I have to talk to him again? I'm in Oi. Why do I still have to talk to you? I believe I can oh, help okay. you in your fight against the Tenlands. How would you advise me to- You must destroy their nests. It's, it's sad, sad, but the only but way, the to, only stop way to stop their numbers growing there are most likely three around here. I can point you in the direction to one. I would have taken care of it, but my village cannot spare my presence here. I must hide them. And how would I go about destroying the nests? You must burn them and kill the dominant one. Or else they will build again. We see them especially at dawn. After that, we no longer see them. But be careful, the night belongs to the Tenlands. That is when they are most awake. Going out at night is very dangerous. I thank you for your advice. Yeah, we that sounds like a perfect time to go out. I must be going. Katasach advised us to speak with Okay, the let's go to talk missing. to the missing Perhaps villagers. They might know first. where the tenants have built their nests. Good day. I've been sent here by your Denegad. He asked me to help you. I hope he is right. 
and that you are not like the Moin Shakers. My sister has gone missing. It is for that very reason that I am here. To attempt to find her or to understand what has happened. Then I will tell you what I know. Perfect. Thank you. Oh, uh, description first. She, like? she is a very beautiful young woman. Kind and sweet. I miss her so very much. Is she very careful? Does she know she should be wary of the beasts? Oh, yes. She knows it very well. But she has been star-eyed of late. And the stars make you forget all caution. Star-eyed? What does that mean? How long has she been missing? Two nights have gone by since. She told me that she was going to gather berries. It was early in the day, but she never returned. I called for her from the edge of the village, in vain. And the ten lands were roaming. Do you know where she usually goes picking? Certainly. In the clearing. We find a great many berries there. Is there anyone in the village that might want to harm her? No. No. Everyone loves her. Maybe a little too much. Why do you say that? Really? She is beautiful and young. The mind shakers took notice. And the boys of the village did as well. What do you oh think boy. is likely happened? She might have been attacked by the Tenlands. But it was early, and they come out mostly at night. You think it might have been something else? I hope. Oh, boy. Even if it is a strange hope. Perhaps she was taken by the mind shakers. They were pestering her the other day. They behaved without respect. A boy intervened and did. chased them off. But you think that they might have captured her when she was outside of the village? That merits inspection. I must leave now. Okay. Let's go talk to the other family. And see about that person. And then we can go and find, um... We can either go and find the missing people or destroy the ten limit nests. Wait, 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 wait. I actually need that on me. Do I have that? Um. Will this do? We're gonna have to try this one. Good day. Oh boy. My name is Desarde from the congregation. I've been told that someone dear to you has disappeared. Yes. My little brother, he left to go fishing, like every day, and he did not return. Your Denegar asked me to help you. Any information you can give me will be very useful. This is true. Oh boy. I hope your words to be heartfelt. Mm. My insides are twisting in fear that my brother is lost. Yo, could, could you think that these two have a Can loot? you describe your brother for me? Just, just he think about young, it. Rather tall and strong. The girls find him handsome. He is such a nice boy, but he is wild. Off There's the no way. Often his curiosity gets him in trouble. Can you tell me? There's actually no way. Where and under what circumstances? It was two days past. I saw him leave to go fishing as he was often to do. And you cannot remember anything out of the ordinary? No, he was full of joy, full of life. I am so worried about him. There's no way that these Did two Did your brother won't. have any enemies? No, I can't think of anyone who would plant strangleweeds in his garden. Perhaps a youthful rivalry. He didn't get along particularly well with the Master Hunter. Nothing serious. Perhaps the missionaries. He did get into a fight with them. But they surely wouldn't have taken him. It's still a lead. Was he close to anyone? He has been dreamy and more joyful than usual. 
Those are the signs of someone. Oh my God! He no longer wants to share secrets with me. He told me that he has grown beyond the shadow of his brother, and the birds in his branches are his. What do you think most likely happened to him? He could have he come eloped. face to face with Tenlands. They've become angry of late, but he knew how to avoid them. He might have had a run-in with the Mind Shakers as well. He got into a fight with them a while back because of a young girl in our village. You think the missionaries yeah. might have sought vengeance? I don't know, but he might have went to find them in their village. He bears no good feelings towards them. I will go and see. Of course not. Maybe they can tell me more. I must be leaving. Okay. Um. I want this one. I guarantee you they eloped. I can. I guarantee you. They, there's no way they didn't. There's actually no way that they didn't elope. There's no way. The, the way that they were talking about it and everything just made it seem more and more likely that they eloped. And I find it very, very hard to Here believe is what they did. three didn't. nests that I needed to destroy. May the enlightened protect me in this battle. Alright, here's a nest. We can get this while we're here. Dominant one only came out at dawn. I should come back later. All right, I don't have an elemental damage one on me, so it doesn't seem worth to. What the hell? What are you floating at? It doesn't seem worth to do it now. Maybe if I find a campsite or something. If I find a campsite, it might be worth doing it then. I want to find these two kids first. Here comes our pay, boys. Wait, hold on. There's a boss right here. Whoa! I was not expecting to run into a boss. No! May the shadow engulf our enemies. Let's go. Horn of the for Forest King. Ooh. Ooh. What do you have on you? Rich Merchant's Key. Interesting. I don't like the way he dies. I don't like that. It makes it feel like he's gonna get back up. And I don't want him to get back up. 
Alright, so we have a merchant's key, and I have no idea where to use it. And it looks like there is a campsite over here, maybe? Yeah. Yeah, give me this. Um, let me check my storage. Oh, fuck yeah. Just in case I'll take these with me. And then I'll put this in and this one away. this away and then put this away as well because I'm not going to use that and then upgrade oh can you not upgrade hats that's so unfortunate I was going to upgrade my hat well never mind then Alright, now I need to find out where these kids are. A basket full of berries and a trap full of fish. All of it scattered and half eaten by beasts. Our two lost souls were here together. They must have been attacked, or they wouldn't have left these behind. Let's search the of area. Of course they're Maybe here together. Find their trail. Why wouldn't they be here together? They're eloping. Clearly. It's over here. Is that blood? That cabin seems home to some creatures. Let's be wary. It could very well be the lair of that great tenland the hunter spoke of. And we might be in here too. the dead end. Watch out. Be especially prudent bringing the large white tenlin inside this cave. It is terribly ferocious and the others, other beasts obey its orders. Our whole plan depends on it, so try not to become His another of its was victims. A the two others are more recent. A man in the world, a missing couple men. Whoa! May the enlightened protect me in this battle! that these missionaries use such a ruse to achieve their goals. Two youths died because of them. Now you understand why some of us fight against Dirinaigse. Their words are always sweet, but all they bring is death. Okay, well, we can destroy this now. 
Let's return to the village. Their families need to be informed. They definitely do, but there is a cave in here. This is a cave. And caves, you know, need to be explored. Um That must be to the exit. Oh, okay. I didn't realize that that was a turnaround for that or for this place. I would have just gone this way then. Take me away. What is up here? Chesty boy. I like chests. Okay, now we can leave this place. I wish I could upgrade my hat. I think hats deserve to be upgraded. Oh, that, and we can go back for the, um... For the other nests now, too. Ooh, I didn't even think of that. Until just now. The hunter told me that I would find a nest in this area. Ooh, hi! I thought I got bigger one. Yeah. 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 Oh, we're gonna wait here. After I grab this. Hell yeah! Give me that skill point! It is dawn. The ideal man. I must kill the dominant one yeah. to destroy him. Yeah. May the enlightened protect me in this battle. May the shadow engulf our enemies. Is that the dominant one? Huh. Oh. The dominant one was kind of a pushover. The dominant one was actually kind of a pushover. Alright, there was a third nest close by. Okay, I don't know why that guy wasn't doing anything. I still want the merchant's chest from that key that we picked up. From over here. We picked it up from this boss over here. I have no idea where to use it. It's gotta have like... 
a legendary in it or something. Cause he, uh, as far as I know, each boss has a legendary near it or something like that. I don't know. So far I haven't like not found a legendary for a boss that I killed. I thought that was all of them. Or no, one was in the, okay, one was in the cave. I might have to search up the location for that merchant's chest or something. Wait, what? Do you know? Yes. I'm oh, truly very sorry. Oh no. Nah. Sir Tonsidag, please do not tell me that she is dead. I found her body in the lair of the great tenement. Not far from the clearing. But how could she have been surprised by the beasts? She knew the danger. She went out to meet the young fisherman. The time must have flown by into the night. I'm so sorry. We found them both dead. I must bring her body back to carry out the right. You should not go alone. I killed as many as I could, but it would be better to be prudent. I shall follow your counsel on Ol Manawi. Two deaths are enough. Thank you. Thank you. Tell me about the ten months. About before, I only very rarely came across. But now they they've even been. Do you know very I must leave now. Okay, I just wanted to get this location. We can tell that guy about um his brother's death. Real quick. It's so, like, it, it's so bad to find out that your brother is dead from ten limbs. Well, on Not only that, but to be, um, I found him, but tricked. I'm truly sorry your brother is dead. May the earth welcome him. I felt it. How did it come to pass? He knew every stone on our lands. It couldn't have been an accident. He had a liaison with a young girl from the village. They would meet in a clearing. And they must have forgotten the hour. Night took them by surprise and attend them across their path. I found both of them in the cavern of the beast. How terrible. Why did he go to see the girl in secrecy? They could have... I must recover his body. To give it up to the earth, as is our custom. Where is it? With the body of the girl he loved, in a cavern near the clearing. But it is a dangerous place. Other tenlands might still be roaming there. Though I did kill quite a few. I have a duty owed to my little brother. Thank you, Onol Manawi. I will not forget this. I must be leaving. Okay, uh, families have been informed. Let's go back this way. It's behind the village. How do I get over there? Hmm. Looks like there's another campsite over here too, right next to the village. That's good. I think there's two in this area. I don't remember off the top of my head. Three, okay. 
How do I get over there? How do I get back there? There's got to be a way down there. Hmm. I don't... I don't know. Like, scour this little place here, but it's, I don't think it's going to show me anything. Maybe if we're under the other side? Or maybe that's it right there. Maybe? Yeah, okay. Given the presence I didn't know there's a little pathway over here. There must be a nest not far from here. The ideal moment. I must kill the dominant and destroy the strong. Yeah. The you know, I thought the um the alpha would have been the same looking as the other ones. As the one in the cave. The master hunter will be relieved to hear it, I'm sure. The nests are destroyed, and with the death of the white tenon, the attacks should cease. And we are even able to convince the missionaries to leave. Katasak should be willing to follow us then. Let's go find Alright, that's level 18 for you. I want to know where that key is, though. Or no, not the key, the legendary is. What's the key that I picked up? Two extra points. What will this give me? That would actually be kind of useful. Yeah. I almost don't want to take it though. All right, I need three points for that. Let me see about that key. Stop it. This man seemed to have fled a long distance. His belongings must be somewhere upstream of the river. The river being here. We need to find this man's belongings. So if we follow the river, we might find the chest or something. Not upstream, this is downstream coming back from where I was. We go back over to where we found him and find that river over there, then we can probably find our possible legendary. I'm hoping it is one. Though, it could be a good chance that there isn't one. I don't know. We'll have to find it. So upstream would be that way. Hmm. this be it? Oh, wait, I see. I see something. 
Message in a bottle regarding Professor. Oh. Okay. It's not exactly what I'm looking for. Upstream from the river. So maybe up here. There it is. That has to be it. Yep. What do we get? Ooh. Ooh. And I can wear all of it? Well, you shouldn't have. Thank you. Let's see. Oh, I actually like that hat. I'm not putting anything on until it's upgraded. Oh, I I love this top. Oh my god. Oh, <gasps> these pants are great. These pants are amazing. But I can't put any of it on until it's upgraded. So, we go back to the camp that we found over here. Upgrade our legendary gear and put it on. If it's better than what I have. That is. It has to be better than what I already have. If it's not, then uh, I'm probably just not going to put it on. I'm going to be honest with you. I might even destroy it. The hat isn't better. I think it was equal, actually. Was it equal? Where's that camp? There's one over here, right? Eh? Yeah. I think the hat was equal. Let me check. No, it was worse, and you can't upgrade hats. No. Don't tell me it'll be the same for this. It already looked. Nope, 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 nope. Hold on. Um, we're gonna go for vigor on this one. Yep, it is better. It is definitely better. Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> nice so we can put everything on except for except for the um the hat we can't put the hat on Alright, in my inventory. We kind of look like a fool, honestly. We have our new outfit. We're now part of the merchants. Look at us. Look at us. And we have two vigor now. Let's go. Two vigor is so good. Bring Catasatch to Constantin. I wonder what he's gonna look like when we get back. He ke he keeps looking worse and worse every time we go back. I can see from your face that you were victorious. Indeed, I put the white Tenlin down, who was enraging his kind, 
and destroyed their nests. The attack should no longer trouble you. As for the missionaries, they decided to leave. My friend Petrus was able to reason with them. We am happy that they accepted to hear your words. And I am happy to have been able to show you that Teleme is not the enemy. In the end, we found the missing young ones. But alas, it was too late. Devoured by wild beasts. And divorced to your end. You did well on Almanawi. Now they should be able to find the rest. Will you agree to accompany me now? My cousin needs your help. We have packed what is needed. I am ready to journey with you. I, I hope this doesn't go down a dark path. I'm going to be honest with you. I hope... It, it seems like... Oh my god. He looks so much worse. It'll be the death of me. I can't control my body. It's... Like being a stranger in a marionette set ablaze, consumed by a smoldering fire. Who is that? The moment's growing near, isn't it? Am I about to surrender my ghost to the Reaper of Souls? You pop in just when you're needed, cousin, as always. Who are you? Your hand is cold as ice. Your cousin is burning. That is such a relief. Let me present Katisach, Constantine. He is the greatest healer on the island. He will help you. Please, stay. I am here for you, Rnaikse. And I will not leave until I found a way to ease your pain and suffering. Fill your mind with the patience of the ocean. I know not how much time I will need. I've never seen such a sickness. The spirits of your lands must be quite horrendous to cast down such evils upon the peoples that live there. Thank you. Thank you, cousin. I don't want to imagine my plight without your intervention. I don't, I don't like where this is going, honestly, I really don't like where this is going, 19, level 9, oh my goodness, 21, but yeah, I really, really don't like where this is going at all. It looks like it's going really badly for him. And honestly, I don't know the guy that well. Like, I know my teammates, I know them really, really well. Constantine is just this guy's cousin. Who's not even actually his cousin. <laughs> Kurt. Kurt's not here, I forgot. I forgot that Kurt wasn't here. That makes me sad. That makes me real sad. Desarde, I'd like to know more about my family. I need to know what became of them. Could you accompany me to see Lady Morange? 
I'm afraid that without you, she may refuse to give me any information. Another time. Let's put it off for now. I must leave you. I need to get a new weapon eventually. Like, honestly speaking, I don't know where to go for a new weapon. Okay, so I need to go a ways to get to where I need to go. I almost hate the fact that I have to run all the way over here. Oh, the camp was over here? <sighs> How rude of you, camp. To be over here and not over where I need to be. But yeah, no, I... Um, I actually like almost hate the fact that I have to run here. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, oh that's where I have to go. Well, how rude of me to assume that it was in the place where I was just at. Teardob, the Blacklands. <coughs> what is out here? Okay, well, I can't go that way. Thought I could. What all is even out here? Is there a boss here? I kind of want to go around like finding all the bosses and find all the legendaries and stuff. You guys have a merchant shop? Oh, you guys are inquisitors. Oh. You are from the continent, are you not? You are different than the people from here. Delighted to see you again, Sister Ephesia. Father Petrus, is that really you? What are you doing here? Merely a courtesy call. How might I help you? Um, that would be all. I don't think I actually have to talk to you. At least not yet. Let's go ahead and set up camp here. Wait, what was Y? What does Y do? Oh, I can gather my companions here? Sick! I don't have many! But sick! Um... I feel like I should question their chief first. But we can go in here and talk to them. Good day. Are you the wise man of this village? Burt tir du mud, renaik say. Oi and the donegad. Yes. I would like to ask you a few questions if you don't mind. The people of your island are constantly asking questions, yet reject any answers that displease them. Questions have no value when one already claims to know the answers. But... 
It is your case. You believe you know the answers. You seek only their echo. Answer your own questions. At least then the answers will please you, and we shall be done with your foolishness. That is not what I... Kwa Awelemseg. May your answers fill your day with the bounty. That's interesting. That's like... That's something really good to say to a smartass. Actually. I wish I could just remember that. Just to, you know, if ever a smartass tries to ask me a question, I can just say that to them. You guys got a merchant around here? I'm in need of new weapons. Bear dear to mad on all Menawi. I am Derdra, daughter of Enora, daughter of Rowena, Mal of this clan. Is it you who helped my warriors discover what the men of the Red Sun were doing? Indeed. Then I thank you. It's probably because you are an Onol Menawi that you are different from the other Renaikse. What do you seek? Questions. I need to be going. No! It is it's so laggy in here. I didn't mean to do that. What do you seek? Mm. Can you tell me something Let's about your the beliefs? beliefs first? We believe that we are part of an everything, and that life depends on a balance that comes from this everything. Our strength is drawn from that which we protect, all that surrounds us. And that which surrounds us feeds and protects us in return. What can you tell me about your rituals? Ah, oh, you have heard this question before. You sound like the mind shaker woman. The rituals are the business of the Donegada, not of the Renoixe. Anything more? Concerning this story about a cult. Enough! Enough questions. I have nothing more to say. Why won't you answer me? Oh, you have a quest. What do you seek? Concerning this story about a cult. Enough. Enough questions. I have nothing more to say. There's the area, question the village inhabitants. That's so rude. To question the village inhabitants is so Wait, rude. Me. Even your thoughts are... Can't you leave us alone? Monist traitor. An Anormenawe does not wear the dress of this. Beertir to Madre Naikse. Good day. Do you want something? Could you answer a few questions? Questions, questions. It is a word that you adore. Let us play a game. If you answer my questions, I will answer yours. If it's the only way to get answers, then let's play. I am pleased. We will have fun. But beware, no lies. What name is given oh. the place from where you come? I come from answer. Suri, a grand city on the continent of Gekane. Really? It is possible that you come from there, but I believe that this is not your land. Your turn. Um... This is a delicate question, but would you know anything about a demon? A demon? I think that that is what the bright and shiny mind shakers call the spirits, no? There are spirits everywhere. In you, and in us, in each tree, in each spring. There is not only one. I cannot tell you more if you are not more precise in what you seek. Let's try something else. Are you on all Menawi with your land? Or did you inherit your link from your parents? I'm not bound. 
Or at least I haven't done anything in particular to bind myself. Then it was your parents. One of them at least must have been Donegad. Your turn. So one of his parents is a healer? Tell me about the missionaries that came here. The Moine Shakers came here to our home and tried to convince us to abandon our ways. No one wanted to listen to them, so they finally decided to leave. I suppose that they were full of disappointment, or angry, or simply tired. And then the others arrived. The woman is truly strange. She is aggressive and spies on us at every turn. I would prefer that she leaves as well. It was fun. More than with a woman who makes light. She did not want to play. Woman that makes light. Hmm. You have a strange stare, Renaixe. Leave me alone. Or just answer my questions, please. Oh, this must be training. Why did that one girl stop talking to me? I had. Give me your axe. Give me your axe. I'll interrupt your ritual. Give me the axe. Oh, there's somebody up there. Will you talk to me? What do you want? Um. What can you tell me about your rituals? Our rituals? Nothing. Nothing at all. They do not concern me. I am not a Denegad. Huh? Even you. You should be able to tell that. Why you bother me with these questions? I am only a gatherer. Go and bother someone else. How rude. What can you tell me about the beliefs of your... The beliefs of the village? That is a strange question for an Onol Manawi. Our beliefs are the same as those of the other clans. We believe really? in the earth that carries us and feeds on our dead. In the rain that quenches us and drowns us. In the beasts that feed us and in those that eat us. I do not know what more I can say to you. Everyone shares these beliefs. You're different from the others. What is your role in the village? Different? Why? Well, for one, you answer me when I speak. You others, when we don't answer you, you start digging for answers everywhere else. I am a gatherer. I hunt a little. I do my part for the life of the village. Tell me about the missionaries that came here. Those who wear the symbol of the sun on their clothing. When they came, they spoke about their bright and shiny god. They told us we were wrong, said that nature was just nature and not to be worshipped. These men know nothing. We ignored them. They finally left and then the woman came to us. She sniffed around everywhere, asking many questions just like you. I was told that she tried to enter my own home. I even saw her trying to follow me in the woods. She must be careful. It is easy to get lost in the woods. Or cross paths with wild beasts. This is true. It is very this easy to find strange to you, those but... beasts. Do you know anything about a demon? A demon? A dark spirit, if you prefer. No. There is no such thing as dark spirits. Your question is not strange. Foolish, perhaps. Hmm. I must leave now. Thank you for your help. No dark spirits, they say. It's quite interesting. And then there's the one thing that we did not do before going up there, and that was talk to these people. 
Anything new? So no. why are they here? The investigation has gone stale. Perhaps you should talk to them. I managed to exchange a few words with some villagers, but I admit they don't... And did they tell you anything worth sharing? I know little more about their beliefs. They worship nature and do not intend to change. It is certainly different from the luminous faith, but it's hardly demonic worship. Yet, there's something strange about this village. One of the villagers that spoke with me seemed truly worried. On edge, even. I think I know of whom you speak. A man always looking over his shoulder. He often sneaks out of the village like a thief. I attempted to follow him, but he always eludes me. I tried to get into his hut to see if he was hiding anything. But someone was always there. Then we should give it a try. Perhaps we'll... Mm, this fellow did not seem very honest to me. If he's hiding something from us, perhaps we can find out what it is by searching his house. He doesn't look inclined to let us in. We'll have to distract him. We could break one of so the I have to somehow find a way to distract him. I can pretend to be clumsy, but we'll have to work fast and it will only... Do you want something? Might I ask you a few questions about the villagers? More questions? You really like this game. You really do. If we could avoid the... Very well. But be brief then. Because it is not good. What can you tell me about that man down there? I spoke to him and he seemed... Nervous. Don't hold it against him. The people of the light have already questioned us. That makes him distrustful. He is a man of few words. But he is devoted to the village and listens to the Danae God with great attention. He is a gatherer, but everyone knows he wants to become the next Voglendijk, the next servant of Donegad. Where does this man live? Down there. His dwelling is right in front of my own. I would like to take a look inside. What? Why would you want to do that? It is his... I really must go inside. I need to clarify something. If you can help us. This request is strange. I know it is for you as well. But we must prove that these suspicions cast upon our village are not true. These people of Teleme will not give up their search without this. Hmm. Very well. I shall distract him. But be discreet and very quick. And be respectful of what you find there. Be good. Ma'am, yes ma'am. What a horrible mask. How can someone wear such a thing unless they're worshipping some dark creature? This is just a mask they wear in battle to intimidate their enemies, nothing more. This altar is incredibly morbid. I wonder what sort of spirit could be venerated in this way. This is exactly the kind of proof we've been looking for. An evil cult. Far from some naive veneration of nature and other island spirits. The man that worships a magic lamp speaks of being naive. Oh, how it is charming. Siora, I am sorry. What I really wanted to say was that... Leave it, old man. I know exactly what it is you wanted to say. This painting is frightening, evoking war, a massacre, a bloodbath under the likeness of a grimacing face. All these gruesome and bloody horrors leave no room for doubt. There is a demonic cult here. We should go tell Sister Ephesia. I don't... I don't know if it's a demonic cult, but... It does look pretty bad. Did you learn anything? Honestly. No. Nothing more. We I was able to sneak into the hut of our mystery man. And what did you discover? Some troubling things. A ritual mask, a rather morbid altar, 
and a fresco depicting a massacre. By the Enlightened. To think these unholy things were so near. Finally, the proof we need that there's a blood-worshipping cult here. They cannot perform their heinous pagan rituals in the village. And I'm certain that it's where our nervous friend sneaks off to. I fail to find where he goes. But you have already proven more competent than I. I shall try. Oh, clearly. You won't lead us into a trap. You are not to me. And good luck. I'll find him. him. Um. I want to put away a couple things first. Oh, large cleaver. Hello. I wish I could upgrade it. I also wish I could use one of these. I did want to put a few things away because I think I'm holding on to too much. These don't weigh anything, but these do. Okay, there we go. That should make me a little bit lighter. Not a whole lot, but enough to make it look like I run a little faster, even though I really don't. <clears throat> oh my goodness. But yeah. Here we could hide and wait. We would be able to see I won't where be running slower if I pick anything up. Nightfall. My child. It's time to wake up. Our nervous friend is here. I knew I was going to have to fight these things and I also knew if I got any closer to him while he sees anything, we get caught. I don't want to get caught this time. Through this door made out of roots. What, what the hell happened? just happened? You were so pale. Did the lightning struck tree speak to you? In a way. I, I saw many images. They were so real. As if I was the tree itself. Do tell. 
This vision is surely the key to the portal. I was this tree, and my branches were shaken by a storm so strongly that they hurt terribly. The heavens caught fire several times, and I felt the lightning strike and pierce me through and through. A sinister warmth took hold of my entire body in an instant, and flames began to devour me. Life left me. All was calm, and I had a taste of cinder in my mouth. In spite of this, I continued to feel, and the rain began to fall on my roots, and at the very heart of my being, I felt the sap begin to flow again. A shoot appeared on my darkened roots, then the vision dissipated. I have never experienced anything like it before. That's... Interesting. I I don't know what else to say other than this interesting. This stone is adorned with the etching of a drop of water. The drawing on this stone resembles a symbol that must represent the earth. So I have to. The drawing on this stone makes me think of fire. I'm certain. This stone is blackened, eaten away. I think it's supposed to evoke death. Okay, the earth one is the one to uh, Evidently, I shouldn't have let this happen. Maybe I'm lucky to protect me in this battle. Tell us again exactly what you saw, my child. I was this tree, and my branches were shaken by a storm so strongly that they hurt terribly. The drawing on this stone storm? resembles a symbol that this stone is adorned with the etching of a drop of water. This stone bears the image of a storm, or perhaps the wind. The drawing on this stone represents lightning. So, storm, I think lightning was next. Here this looks like a snowflake. The snow, or maybe ice. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's death. Death is last. What was the next one? Fire. The drawing on this stone makes me think of fire. Fire, so what's the next one? I already lit this candle. This drawing looks like an infant. Could it represent light? I think it's water. I must have lit the candles in the wrong order. Maybe I'm lucky to protect me in the battle. May the shadow engulf our enemies. Is it death, life, and then water? So it's this one first, then this one, then. This way, hold on. And then death, maybe? No, I heard him say water first and then life. You did it right. By awakening these stones in the right order, the door opened. That's so. That, that's, that's something to like, bring a story to life through stones. What the hell? Quiet. Close duis, atu deliam canade dole, tadulan verandi, alaun eles agen ole vei. Klosi garamam i talami ol flinau ich egrem. Klosi gadem da yentis ol arabini a ol slai. Vanqua sa kengadem fradem a digalem. Linquid winter bo so galansani. 
What are they working? Ritual. I have never seen anything like it. The rituals of my they quite as scared. In any case, Teleme's story suddenly sounds way more plausible. The Denegad who performed the ritual was the villagers. We should go talk to Dedra. What are they doing? That must be why they choose certain people here to run under the Dernagon. What do you seek? We found your sanctuary and assisted in one of your blood rituals. Was the apparition we witnessed the demon the priests were talking about? What is clear is these priests know nothing, and you know nothing. The ritual. I've never seen anything like it. I hoped you'd be able to explain what they were trying to achieve. As you can see, my companion is not a Renaigse like the others. He bears our likeness. Please share your knowledge with us. Grant us the chance to understand. Very well. I'll attempt to help you make sense of what you witnessed. The ritual you saw is a ceremony to summon forth the strength of our warriors. Our people have always lived in harmony with nature. Our very existence revolves around her. She talks to us and takes on many faces. What you have witnessed is just one of many. Confronting the threat that the Renoixi make up, we called them for their blessing, and they appeared to us. Can we contact them? I mean, is communication possible? What you witnessed was not a discussion, but if you visit a sanctuary, you may see one of the faces, and then you will be able to talk. Pass the mountains and head to the swamps. There, if you perform the ritual, you will see them come, though what you will hear may not be to your liking. I'm curious. I want to know. I'm also going to pick up the side quest real quick. I need to be going. Well, I... Never mind. I don't know why it's not giving me this item class. But yeah, no, I want to know about this ritual. I wasn't planning to go like on for this long, but I'm just so intrigued and interested and it's peaking like a little interest that I didn't know that I had. I don't know if that makes sense. But I just, I want to know more. And I love the color that that tree glowed. That was such a beautiful blue. It was, it was such a beautiful like sea and blue. Or cyan. I don't know how it's pronounced. I'm going to be honest with you. I could just be butchering it. What are those? I'm gonna fight it. I love the um. I love the look of some of these like, their these enemies in this game. I think they're very very unique, but not all of them are different. If that makes sense. 
Wait, have I been here? I wonder if there's like a guardian out here or something. I'm so curious about this place and what it entails and what it has here. What the hell is that? Is that a lizard? Is that a lizard type? What the hell? Wait, remind me not to be here. Gotcha. Understood. Don't don't go there. Don't look for the boss. Got you. I just I want to know about it. I want to see it. I guess I'll have to, like come back later, I guess, or something like that. If I really want to find the boss of the area, if there is one. Probably best if I just got out of here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm more than fast enough to just run away and just get out of here. It's such an open area to you. Vedvilvi? Um, hmm. Okay, this place I might explore. There's a camp here, that's good. Go ahead and take this time to dismantle things. If I have anything that I can dismantle. What's this? Oh, 
Find the sanctuary indicate. Okay. I guess I'll actually go look for it. I realized my cape changed, even though I didn't want it to. Why did my cape change? That was so weird. Um... Coming out of the area. This is a swamp sanctuary, but what's here? I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be looking for here. Oh, hello. Potion of the Demonic Ritual. It would be enough to pour a simple concoction of nightshade berries to call the creature. The ritual probably relies on the fact that these poisonous berries have purifying properties in small doses. Unless it is pure imitation, the poison on the berries, the poison of the swamp. Hmm. I don't have lock picking too, and I don't have a key. Do you have the key? No, you do not. And what's the other thing that I got then? Notes. Message. Where's the recipe? Oh, these are the guardians? Hmm. Looks like I found a few already. I guess I need to explore the area to find out what I need for this place. Or something like that. Age torn. Oh. Alright, I just got a key from that guy, so that might open the chest that we tried to open a second ago and couldn't. Maybe. Move. You guys are in my way. Move. They're always in the way. this I found the mosquito saw the drum for it I, I don't think that's a mosquito I think it's just a bug maybe Wait, the Bridge Alliance is here? Potion of the Demonic Ritual. 
Okay, so they already had the potion here. Alright, well, before we go back over there and maybe use it, I want to see what else we need. Or if we need anything else. Oh, boom. There's a place back here. I don't know how to get back there. Hmm. How do you get back there? Here's the snake. I think. Where's the frog? Then. What a strange party we have here. Who are you to come and disrupt our solitude? Good day. We. You. You are on Old Menawi and at the same time. Renaixi. So it is possible to bond yourself on your faraway island. We are here because Teleme has asked us to carry out an investigation. They think that certain clans venerate a demon, an evil creature. We carried out our investigation of Vedlog on Chief Durda in an attempt to discover the truth. And the clues have led us to find our answers in this sanctuary. Durda sends you to seek out a demon? Curious. A man from your island came already a long time ago. Full of questions he was as well. He had a small party of warriors with smoking tubes. And on their chests, a golden lion. A lion? The, the gold of lion. Of the bridge alliance. In <coughs> territory. Such boldness. They set up a camp near here and then they disappeared all of a sudden. Do you know where precisely? It was a long time ago. I don't remember all that well. My memory has been leaving me of late. But it wasn't far from here. You will find it. I, I think we already found it. Ah, you are bringing back the memories. They were asking nearly the same question. Okay, uh, I think we already found... Who the hell are you? Dude popped up out of nowhere. I think we already found the camp though. Lead the search in the swamps. So an optional is to question the old hermit. So let's do that first. What do you want, Just because it's already here. Stranger? Um, I found this note. It speaks of a ritual, but it is incomplete. Do you know anything else about it? A ritual? Yes, there is a ritual for the impatient. For me, it serves no purpose. I am here. I wait. But for me, it would be useful. Can you help me? Do you see those drums over there? They awaken the earth as long as you play them correctly. They will awaken the earth. Oh. oh, and that's not all. Once the earth is awakened, the stone will appear that must be quenched. Quench a stone. But you're still here. What do you want again? Speak about How the do you drums. play the drums. Oh, that's easy. The music is the first language of Tiafradi. It resonates with the earth. You need only respect the natural order for the earth to hear you. A predator, a prey, the cycle. <sighs> that's not really a all predator. That clear. Come now. No, that's actually kind of clear. 
You must first make the snake rattle. Unless it is first to be the insect. Alas, time devours all memories. I do remember one thing, though. I'm listening. Each drum must only be played one time. And only once. But you're still here. What do you want again? One time. Punch a stone. Only what once. What does that mean? Water trickles on the stone and returns to us, empowered by its force. But sometimes, water is not enough. This note I found explains a recipe. A potion thought to contain the essence of this place. That's what must be poured over the stone. Oh, yes. No doubt. But you're still here. Nothing. Okay, I don't want to beat the drums without beating them in the correct order, so we're gonna do this. We saw the snake and the mosquito already, but where's the frog? Fresco. It represents a beast of the marshes, a red serpent. It represents a beast of the marshes, a red serpent. Beast of the marshes. I hope you guys can remember this chat. A beast of the marshes. Marshes. The fresco. Oh, was the frog in here? Ah, oh, it was. <sighs> the image is fading. I can't see much of anything. It's the frog. And then the last one, or the first one is over here, which would be the mosquito, or the, the insect in this case. A fresco in various yellow hues. It represents a sort of insect. Now, the, I, I have to figure out the, uh, the order, but I don't know. It's either insect, frog, snake, or snake, frog, insect. Something's appeared over there. It seems as if it's oh, I got it right. altar. Looks like an altar. We already picked up the stone or the the potion. What is this? A guardian, maybe? It's got to be a guardian. That's two guardians in one day. Let's go. Dear Thompson Dark! Killed! You killed her! Monsters! Murderers! 
You knew her, old man? Before she became a Nadaig. May the earth swallow you whole. You and those from their dark oil. They must all be destroyed. But in all Milfrekti men will stop them. He will chase you all away. Murderers! His hunt has begun! Calm down. We didn't have a choice. We were only defending ourselves. Siora, what is he talking about? Why is he so furious, and who is Enon Mil Frichtemann? I believe he is furious because he knew the Nadaig before she bonded. He mourns her in this way. It was a Donegad who received very much power, and who traded herself completely. Are you saying that that creature was once a woman? Yes, like you and me. Anyone who draws upon the power of the Earth becomes one of their faces in exchange. As for your other question... Enon Mir Frichtemann... One of a thousand one faces. of a thousand faces. This name rings a bell. I've heard it before. It is surely the name of the demon we seek to expose. Enon Mir Frichtemann... <laughs> I doubt that you can understand. But enough to think that this being wants us harmed. Perhaps it's the source of the Malachor. And why is that? Why would the source of your sickness come from here? I don't know, Siora. But didn't this man just say that this being would hunt us down? We need to learn more. You are who I was here for. Hmm, what quest are we doing right now? There is a guardian here that I am looking for. And, um, I want it. I just don't know how to get to it. Hmm. Unless I already have the weapon on me. No. I want my weapon! That's what I came here for. Originally. I knew this is the place where a, um, a guardian was. I just didn't know where the guardian was. If that makes sense. Medal of St. Matthias. That's what I got. I need two willpower for that. That's uh, not exactly what I was looking for. In all honesty, that was not exactly what I was looking for at all. Um... Back to the village, please. Alright, well, we just killed that guardian who I thought was going to give me a sword. And did not give me... Actually, you. Do you have any weapons for me? Do you? You do have any weapons for me. Ooh. Do you have any, um, straight swords? By chance? No? No straight swords? Um... Let's take this, then. I still can't use any of these, so it's not like those are gonna matter. Yeah, okay. 
I can upgrade here. Oh, no, stop. Sorry, I did not mean to speak to that guy again. Okay, see, I am using this, but if this will give me more damage, then I will use this instead. Yes, please. Go ahead and destroy that, because I don't have a guy who can use two-handed weapons anymore. I miss you, Kurt! I miss you! My favorite character in the game. But oh, we have a new weapon. It actually looks nice. Alright, did did you survive? You have answers. Which must mean, alas, that one of the Nardaig is with us no longer. You are a great warrior. You could almost be a storm warrior. What do you seek? You set a trap, the trap in the swamp. Invoking and releasing that creature. It is true. And the Nadaig is indeed one of the faces. A spirit of the oil. I was hoping that you would disappear. The swamps do not like to give back those who enter. You have seen things that no stranger to our clan has ever seen. Secrets that no one must know. But you survived. You are strong. I should not have taught you so weak. The ritual. This is how you prepare the blood sap. What are you talking about, Siora? No one knows the recipe. But it is the very barn that allows her warriors to enter into a trance. And to rise again when they have fallen. It is true. You do not know the ingredients, but you know now how the blessing works. I have nothing more to give you than my excuses. And that you keep to yourself all that you have seen. You are a brave on all Manawi. And I would like to request your help. You request my help. Oh, now we get the, the thing. You helped us to find the camp of the soul, Lasser. And you have proven your valor fighting the Nardaig. So, yes. I am asking for your help. In saving the people who are suffering in this camp. What do you intend to do exactly? Attack and destroy this camp and those who live in it to set my people free. And how am I supposed to help you? My clan is powerful, but so are these soul lasser. I need more warriors. Eseld of the Gaius Rad is in my debt, but I'm afraid she might refuse to honor it after her clan was defeated. You know how to talk to people. And you are friends with her twin sister. I would like you to go and convince her to help me. I suppose I could try it. Wait, I'm friends with her twin that sister? Since when? It would also be good if you could fight alongside us to set these prisoners free. Meet us near the camp with the forces you managed to assemble. Do I... Need... Ooh. See, I want to I want to up my strength, but my endurance increases maximum life and balance. That leaves me with heavier armors. But I need at least accuracy one to use a new. No, 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 no. Uh, heavier armors is great. Attribute required to wield one of the. Best one hand slash two hand blunt weapons. Um, what do I need currently? Endurance four. That's agility three. I almost want to just do agility four. Yeah, screw it. Why not? Agility four. Um.
One second, guys. Yo. Yo, what's up? Alright, uh, I got called about food. Sorry about that. It was like right in the middle. Oh, I did not mean to come down here. It was like right in the middle of the stream, too. Or like, eh, somewhere towards the end. I want to get this, uh, quest done, though. I've been curious about the side quest this whole time, but there's another side quest that I would need. For, oh, they're not here no more. They move? Where do they go? There's another side quest that I or I think I believe it's a side quest that I need for um for a legendary sword that I wanted. We'll do this real quick. Try and you know run through it and then We'll probably end off here. Or at the end of this. Sound good to you guys? Sounds good to me because I'm getting kind of hungry. I told him that I'd call him back in a minute. It's Rad the Redwoods. Yeah, but I heard tale of a uh, sacrifice sword. And it's in that area that we were just in. But I, can't, I don't think I can get that sword anymore because I decided to save the other place. Maybe, I don't know for certain. Siora. Asir, always with your new friends. Bertir to Madiseld, I'm happy to see you. What do you want? Could you tell me about Siora? You are right there and you let him talk about you like this? Asir? That's a strange friend you have there. Perhaps I wanted to hear how you'd reply. Perhaps, but I don't like this. Did you want anything else? Deirdre requested that I ask for your clan's help. She intends to attack a camp of the Ordo Luminous to set free their prisoners. The Ordo Luminous? It's the name of the Inquisition. The Red Suns, if you prefer. <sighs> the Sol Lasser. I see. What have they done this time? They're still trying to convert your people by force. Those who do not accept the Enlightened are taken to this camp where they are tortured and killed if they keep resisting. Deirdre needs more warriors for this attack. The Gaius Rad have been deeply weakened by our defeat against the Lions. Deirdre told me that you were in her debt. I am, but she's asking a lot more than what we owe. Our clan might not survive this battle. Since the Guard took over San Mateus, Teleme's presence on Tear D has only been symbolic. This fort must be one of its last bastions. It will not be very difficult to defeat them. And you could get rid of those who want to impose their faith on you by force. If they have no more reinforcements, then you are right. 
We need to join forces with Daedras. I will gather my warriors and talk to them. Did you want anything else? Nope. Sorry. Gaius Rad, Daedra, and her Sengedin Anadas will fight against the Sol Lasser, who torture and kill our brothers. She's asking us to fight alongside her, to set our people free and stop these monsters. Shall we rise to her call? Our spears will rise in defense of our people. Then it is done. Let's raise our spears and leave for battle. You can leave with her. Nice, nice. I'm glad that you're coming with. However, you guys have a merchant here, and I haven't talked to him in a while. God, dude. That's not even a hammer. It's it's an axe. That's not even an axe. What the hell, dude? <laughs> what the hell? What is this? These aren't even good. I like your masks, though. You guys have cool masks. I love this one. I want to wear this. Um, yeah, you guys don't have anything good for me. Do you guys have any, um, I'll take this. You guys have any fury potions? If you want to trade All again, right. you know where to find me. Go to the meeting in this secluded glade. Alright, so I actually have to go this way. The enemies here shouldn't be that bad. If we come across any. That's neat. If you bring them close enough, they'll fight for you. Or with you. That's super neat. Right. This two-handed is slow as shit. But it is what we got. It's what we got. All right, let's get out of here. Where are we going exactly? Why are we going to San Mateus? Hmm? Hmm? Why are we going to San Mateus? So they're over there, which means I would have to go through here, which has been taken over. I thought you guys wouldn't like me here. Sorry, I can set up a camp in here? What the hell? Why would you ever let me set up a camp in here? 
Aren't you guys the coin guard? How do I get to the secluded glade? Is it through here? Maybe? Seems like it is. It also seems like oh, there's a there are people here. Okay. You got really got this hole. Which I have no idea what that means, but he's dead. Are you guys guarding things over here? Wow, he didn't have anything on him. So they weren't really guarding anything either. What a waste. A marquee rapier. And it can be upgraded. I don't think it'll be better. Oh, and it's an agility 4 weapon? Yeah, I'm so glad I upgraded my agility. We're almost at the camp of the Solasser. Should we wait here for the moon to rise? Yes, let's. Wait until nightfall. There you are. And I see that you have brought the guy's rad with you. We could not let the Senged in Anadas take all the glory. I wouldn't expect anything less of you, Ezeld, daughter of Bladnid. Our objective is located beyond this cliff. The Inquisitors are not expecting us. We have the element of surprise. Let's make good use of it. We will be as discreet as a group of docentats. They won't hear us coming. Let's find a vantage point to get a better overview of this fort. So, this is the place where my people are being tortured. I hope we're not arriving too late. Most of their troops seem to be outside, as if they sense we are coming. The prisoners are most likely inside. In some basement, perhaps. And it seems as if there are some in the right wing as well. In that case, the toughest fights will take place outside. That is where I want to be. We must strike quickly if we want to make good use of the element of surprise. Have you thought about how you'd want us to conduct this assault? We are behind the camp where there are fewer guards. Getting inside will prove less troublesome from this side. We will conduct two near simultaneous assaults. The first larger group will attack from the front to cause chaos in the enemy ranks. As for me, my companions and I will get inside the building from the back and sneak into the basement. We will set as many prisoners free as we can and use the opportunity to search the building. Once you have eliminated the troops in front of the building, focus on the right wing. Good. This way we'll attack them from two sides simultaneously. We will conduct the first assault, and then we will go back to intercept the ones who run away. Excellent idea. Are you ready for the assault? When it comes to setting our brother free, we are always ready. In that case, conduct the assault as soon as you're in position. Good. I'm ready. They'll never see me coming. Is 
They will probably hear me coming though. Dude, you guys can clearly see the body. This is where I get caught. This is definitely where I get caught. Let's hurry and reach the prisoners before the Inquisitors kill them all. Maybe they protect me in this battle. We intervened quickly, thankfully. Let's find the keys to these cells. Wait here for now. We're still fighting outside. Okay. Oh, they're upstairs. They're upstairs. May the enlightened always keep you in his divine blessing. Is this just a worker's area? That was uh, something, that's for sure. So they have Inquisitors here. I don't like that. I definitely do not like the fact that they have Inquisitors here. I think that was the last of the Inquisitors. The fort is safe now. Old Luminous's account book. Spending old Luminous, including those related to the secret camp, its construction, and its operating costs. Let's lend a hand to our allies outside, as there are still some prisoners there. And my dogs are working. Love that. Yeah, she goes nuts if any of the if there's any noise outside, I swear. have been dead for days there's no one left to set free let's get out of here yes let's get out of here if I can figure out how to get out of here to search the outside of the secret camp there's a there's a campsite over here I'm gonna grab 
No, man. How did the battle go for you? We prevailed. Your plan was good on all Manawi. Congratulations. And we were able to set the prisoners free. They were completely exhausted, but alive. Do not worry. We will bring them back to Vedluk, so their wounds can be treated. You have shown bravery and righteousness. I will not forget it. I hope to see you in the village again soon. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I love the natives here. Like, screw the Congress. Or the Congression. Or Kalembe. Or Hikmet. I absolutely love the natives here. They're like so nice, but they're on the wrong side of the story. Or no, not the story. I I, I think they're just They're on the wrong end of the stick. I don't know how to I don't know the wording, or a better wording for that, but it, it just feels like they, they're targeted by invaders and that's just not right. It just doesn't feel right, honestly. Uh, find the Scholar's Expedition Camp. Scholar's Expedition Camp. Oh, that's the other quest. Um... That is the other main quest, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Uh, that's where we're going to end for today then. I didn't realize that was the other one. We're going to end here for the time being and pick up the next quest in the next episode coming soon. But until then, I will see you guys next time.